What's up you guys? This is Steven and I'm back with another photo analysis. This time I'll be analyzing the cover of Kotokumi's single entitled Birthday Eve. And this is the second of 12 singles that Kotokumi released in 12 weeks. This single is supposed to represent the United States and I'm assuming this is the culture of the United States um, it's supposed to represent the culture of the United States that you know more or less like the overall culture like the culture that is transmitted to other um, countries and continents via you know the media and um, when I see this photo, I'm, you know, I like the coloration, definitely. The coloration of the background. Um, her facial expression is a little odd, a bit like a duck, you know. She's trying to go for, I guess, like a pouty, um, like a pouty look. And it's okay. It's all right. Um, her eyes, they're all right, too. They could have had a bit more life behind them. Um, the blonde hair, I guess that's supposed to be a part of the United States because, um, you know, the United States has a lot of blonde people, I suppose. Um, so that's supposed to be, you know, part of her representing the United States culture. Um, so she's wearing like a bikini um, top and, she, you know, she like, you know, birthday -y, woo woo. And I've never heard of a birthday Eve before. Um, I don't. I didn't know that your birthday was that important to have an Eve to it. You know. Um, you know. I've heard of like Christmas Eve and New Year's Eve, but not you know Kotokumi's birthday Eve. Like, nah. You know. I don't think that even Japan would be recognizing you know Kotokumi's birthday Eve. Nevertheless, Kotokumi's recognizing it, so that's what we got. And. For this photo shoot, I'm guessing the theme for, you know, this photo is Birthday Eve. And I guess she's trying to go for, like, a party look. Um, I guess, but, like, it doesn't really seem to, you know, look like anything to do with, like, a birthday, though. I don't really see, like, the birthday part of it being represented. And that's me personally like if you guys see it let me know but I don't see it and she probably should have had like a cake in the photo and she's like blowing out the candles or maybe well probably not blowing out the candles because it's her birthday Eve but maybe had like a birthday cake somewhere in the background or something you know something to do with like you know the day of birth you know maybe some presents maybe um some people planning her birthday party or something. I don't know, but I'm assuming that Kotokumi wanted to keep these photos simple, you know, for her um, 12 singles in 12 weeks, um, you know, photos for her um, single covers. Uh, she wants to keep those simple. I think so. So, you know, she is just, you know, she's kissing it, you know, keeping it simple, stupid. Um... But, um, I think this photo is, it's alright. It's not the best. It's not the worst. It's something. It's decent. Um, her, the way her fingers look, uh, I think that's a little bit odd. Um, I don't know why she did that. I guess she was trying to bring more attention to her lips, maybe. But she probably could have chosen, like, a better positioning are better positioned for her fingers. Um, but I guess she didn't want to. And also if you look at her hand, there's like some hearts that are going like three hearts. So this seems like this probably could be like maybe Valentine's Valentine's Day Eve instead of birthday Eve. You know, this probably this photo probably could work better as a Valentine's Day photo than a birthday Eve photo or a birthday photo. Um, but I guess you know, you live and you learn. 
her hat is interesting. There's like some people are like some pictures of people on top of her hat. I don't know what's up with that. Um, that's interesting. I'm kind of surprised she didn't try to incorporate red, like red, white, and blue into the photo since the photo is supposed to be representative of the United States. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like, you know, the blonde hair, that's something, you know. But I don't think that the United States was really represented in this photo, you know. If I saw this photo without any prior knowledge to it, I wouldn't say, oh, birthday, oh, United States. Eh. But when all else fails, you know, at least deliver a good photo. And the question is, did Kotokumi deliver a good photo? And, eh, I think she delivered a decent photo. You know, I think she did a decent job. So I'll give her a check. But, it could have been better. But then again, it could have been worse too. So, I guess it's just, you know, take it for the good and the bad. By the way, did Kotokumi always have that mole by her lip? Or did she just put that on for this photo shoot? And also, there's like some jewels or some like... It's like something by her eyes. Or by her um, eye on the lip. I don't know what that's about. You know, sometimes you just gotta keep it simple, Kotokumi. Like, was that necessary? I don't think so. Uh, but hey, it's your photo shoot. You can do what you want. But, you know, overall, in my opinion, I don't think the theme of Birthday Eve was interpreted. And I don't think that the United States was represented in this photo. Um, however, I think it's a decent photo. So, I'll give Kodakumi that. It's a decent photo. You know, it could have been worse. It could have been better. It could have been worse, though. Um, but... That's all I have to say for the time being. Thanks a lot for watching. Feel free to comment. Feel free to subscribe. Feel free to give me a thumbs up. It's greatly appreciated. Until the next video, adios and goodbye for now.